Alright, howdy y'all. This is Shane. I'm on my second last song on the album. And this one's been a real ball terror to uh, try and uh, sing. Um, I don't know why. Like, I've done other songs in this key and it's been easy, but I think because I've actually come up with a somewhat of a little melody um, in here that uh, it's actually it's just pushing me a little bit and uh, I think I found the technique I was singing too soft and the volume was too loud but I'm gonna give it a go unfortunately you won't be able to hear the music um, but I'm gonna show you a before and after so uh, it's a reggae track sort of chilled called uh, The One You Love um, inspired by someone that I knew yeah we're gonna give this a go and that was a train I don't know if you heard that or not but Alright, I got my tally on. It's not plugged in, but I like to have it for rhythmic reasons. Um, it's kind of weird, but here we go. So you're gonna cop uh, some Shane Diorio vocals on their own, <laughs> and then uh, you're gonna hear it in context. So the one you love will leave you out to dry. The one you love will make everything alright. When the one you love decides she's had enough, she's gonna walk right out now and I'll leave you with no trust. She's gonna leave right now. She's gonna leave right now. Hearts can break as fast as hands can shake in a moment's time as the seconds go by. I found my luck again, my luck tried its best, but just like the dice I roll, my, my luck's got to end. She's gonna leave right now. Ah. Alright, I kind of stuffed up a couple of bits here, I'm going to go back. In a moment's time, as the seconds go by, I found my luck in, my luck tried its best. But just like the dice I roll my, my luck's got and she's gonna leave right now. <clears throat> Not happy with that either. Comes the little bits and pieces you gotta fix along the way. Already done three other takes, two other takes of this, and uh, haven't been happy with them. So I've been thinking about it for a while, and I reckon this might be the day I get it done. As the seconds go by, I've tried my luck in, my luck tried its best, but just like the dice I roll my, my luck's got her and she's gonna leave right now, she's gonna leave right now. Uh, that last one was kind of wavy and weird. She's gonna leave right now. Yeah, that's better. So what I've done, I've just laid down like first new take for the day. Which I actually already like more than the old one. And uh, sometimes when you record, I mean, obviously singing is not my uh, natural ability. And got, you know, like I wasn't born with the ability. And I've still got a long way to go to get to where I guess I want to be. And, um, but I'm trying to make the best with what I got. Unlike uh, some people who just, you know, I guess wouldn't bother. So, you know, the more I do it, the easier it's getting. I've found um, sometimes the simple approach is the best. It's 
especially with uh, with this sort of stuff, because uh, I mean I've been playing blues for for you know for years, and uh, when I sometimes go into other styles, I realize uh, blues has kind of like limited my approach to certain things. Um, where it's also helped in some ways too, I think, not be limited to just doing one style of music. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give this one more take. And uh, hopefully I get something happening. So we'll mute that. And you're going to hear it all in a sec. The one you love will leave you out to dry. The one you love will make everything alright. When the one you love decides she's had enough, she's gonna walk right out now and I leave you with no choice. She's gonna leave right now. She's gonna leave right now. Hearts can break as fast as hands can shake in a moment's time and as the seconds go by I tried my luck and my luck tried its best and just like the dice I roll my my luck's got her and she's gonna leave <clears throat> I don't like the phrasing on that line. Let's try it a little bit faster. Got it spilled. And just like the dice I my... No. Got it spilled. And just like the dice I roll my... Oh, uh... Child is missed And just like the dice I roll my My locks got my little Fire out, this is retarded Try my luck in My luck child is missed And just like the dice I roll my Luck's got to end, she's gonna leave right now She's gonna leave right now. Alright, so there's two takes plus the original. And there was one more verse I needed to put in here, which I haven't written. So, alright. I'm gonna show you a little bit about oops, the next part of this process, which is I got one more verse I gotta write. Um, so, I'm gonna fire up my computer and see if I can come up with something that, uh, yeah, that kind of fits and works. Here we go. In my life I tried my best so this is the painful part kind of something legit honest at least uh, hmm Oh, I got a concept, but it's not really anything musical yet. Sometimes we lie. 
Stock you down. Yeah, that's alright. Sometimes life will strike you down. Sometimes love will leave your town. Yeah, cool. Now you can like um, I've got ideas ready. So sometimes love will leave your your town. Love will pack its bags and see you round. Alright. Sometimes life will strike you down. Sometimes love will leave your town. Love will pack. No. Oh, yeah. Sometimes Lou will pack its bags. It'll pack its bags and see you around. All right, let's try this one. Sometimes life will strike you down. Sometimes love will leave your town. Sometimes love will, will pack its bags. Uh, it'll pack its bags and see you round. It's gonna leave right now. Now the last line's a little crap. Alright, sometimes love will pack its bags. It'll remind you. It'll remind you once of the things you've had. Let's try that line. These are ideas. This is how I, I work. Like, if I haven't got lyrics to finish a song but I've got the everything done I'll have to just sort of brainstorm ideas that fit the theme and uh, I like to try and just focus on getting it done without having to um, sort of mix and match things when my mind's not on the song so I usually try to sing it and then uh, I'll just do this I'll just try a whole bunch of different lines um, yeah that fit the theme and, and see if we can get it to, to go so here we go Sometimes life will strike you down But sometimes love will leave your town Sometimes love will pack its bags It'll remind you once of the Things you've had, she's gonna leave right now. I think that'll do. I kinda like that. I may have to phrase it a little differently, but here we go, back to the vocals. I'll just give you a quick rundown of what I'm doing here. So on this computer here, we have uh, the recording software, Nuendo, which um, I'm using to track stuff. And over here, I've got my personal computer. And uh, I've, these are the words that I just wrote out. And the bottom lines, uh, two different variations. So I'm going to try that out. Um, this is the hard part because with new words, you generally have to do it a whole bunch of times. So I'm going to put this over here. I'm going to make it big so I can see what's going on. All right. All right, it's a little cold here, but I'm going to try my best. All right. Sometimes love will strike you down. Sometimes love will leave your town. 
and sometimes love will pack its bags it remind you of uh, 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 all right reminding you of yeah that's better see sometimes too many words doesn't work so it'll remind to just reminding 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 you reminding you once reminding you of things you've had all right just try that again I wasn't happy with any of that <laughs> sometimes like will strike you down sometimes love will leave your town sometimes love will pack its bags reminding you of things that you once had had you gonna leave right now oh yeah cool Sometimes life will strike you down And sometimes love will leave your town <clears throat> And sometimes love will, will pack its bags Alright, something bugging me, there's too many sometimes So, sometimes life will Strike you down. And love can and love can leave broken. Alright, I've made three adjustments so far to these words, trying to give them a little more, uh, just, uh, betterness, which is not a word, but I'm going to give that, these new ones a go, and I'll move this around so I can see the monitor over here. And sometimes life will strike you down, and love can leave. You're broken town That's when love will Will pack its bags Reminding you of things you once had You once it had, she's gonna leave right now It wasn't bad, but it wasn't great So I'm gonna do this again, now I'm getting the flow, I kinda like these words And sometimes life. <clears throat> First line of any any uh, thing has to be right, otherwise people cringe. They're probably cringing anyway. And sometimes life will strike you down. <clears throat> and sometimes love will leave you broken down. That's when love will back its bags Reminding you of things that you once Once it had, you gonna leave right now It'll clear out running Alright, let's make some changes Here we go. This is the process. Sing it, change the words, sing it, fix out everything. So it's kind of time consuming. 
I've been at this uh, last verse now 27 minutes in real time. I guess, uh, you know, on the edit, it may only be a few minutes, but um, it's getting there. <clears throat> I'm still getting over this cold, but um, I need to get this done. So, here we go. Let's try this new line. Sometimes life will strike you down and clear out running from your broken town. That's when love will pack its bags, reminding you of things you once had. You once did that, you're gonna leave right now. Now the first part of that was okay. It's just a little kind of lackluster. Let's try it again. But I'm happy with the words. Sometimes life will strike you down and clear out running from your broken town. Yeah, yeah, all right. Let's try this one more time. Famous last words with recording. One more time. Sometimes life will strike you down. It'll clear out running from your broken town. That's when love will We'll pack its bags, <clears throat> reminding you of things you once, once had had. Sometimes life will strike you down. <clears throat> Alright, I'm getting uh, a little frustrated. I can't seem to get my voice to do what I want. So what I'm going to do off camera, I'm going to just sing it with my electric guitar unplugged until I feel comfortable with the uh, the pattern of it. Because I, what I tend to do is um, I don't deliver the way that I intend to and it kind of throws my mind and my voice around it. It's weird. But anyway, I'm going to try that. So uh, I'll be back. All right, I've just done that um, two or three times and I think I've got the pattern down so um, as always this time I'm gonna just have my guitar and act like I'm playing because I, I think that keeps me in time a little better um, although I kinda know where I wanna be sometimes it doesn't always work so let's try this again sometimes life Strike you down and clear out running from your broken town. That's when love will pack its bags, reminding you. Ah, reminding you uh, of things you have. All right. Pack its bags, reminding you of things once it had. Alright, let's try that one more time. Reminding you of the things you've had. I'm going to do one more take of that on this bottom. Or so the second track here, because, uh, like I said, I, I like to at least pick from at least two separate tracks. Now I've got the phrasing of it kind of the way I want it. I'm going to try this other one one more time. So hopefully I can play through this all the way without, like, stuffing up. So here we go. Sometimes life. 
Sometimes life will strike you down and clear out running from your broken town. That's when love will pack its bags, reminding you of the things you once had Alright, that's cool. Now we listen back. And what I do, I listen back to one whole take, well, one take, and then uh, basically chop all the bits that I don't like at all out. And then I listen to the other track and chop out all the bits I don't like. And then if there's any bits that aren't on the other track that I like, that fill the spot that I don't like, then I have to patch it. Um, and this can be frustrating, like different days your ear hears different things and like I said, if I was a natural singer, it would probably be a lot easier, but um, you know, I've been doing this a few years now and uh, it's, it's getting there, it's getting there. At least I'm, I'm trying to work with what I got and uh, I find that to be better than me trying to like fake a voice and then singing that voice like a lot of people do, which I don't understand at all, actually. There's so many... Anyway, that's a whole other story. It's just established singers that act when they sing, and it's so bad. They talk like one way, and they sing in somebody else's voice, which is, like, just bizarre. I don't, I don't get that at all. But anyway, what I'm going to do now is chop up this track and uh, see if we've got something I can work with. All right, now this part of it, what I'm gonna do is just basically, like I said, chop up, um, or have a listen back to some of the vocal parts and see how they fit in the mix. So you'll get to hear what's going on. Uh, I'm gonna start with the first one, which will probably be the least strong out of the two. And we're gonna take from there. Um, I've got some effects on here. I'm going to use the uh, waves. Oops. I'm going to use the waves um, C4. Because you know what? I really like this pop vocal setting it has here. It just adds a real nice niceness to everything. So I'm going to put that first, then a de esser, then reverb, then a compressor. Right out now and 
I leave you with no choice, he's gonna leave right now. Alright, I just ran a, a, a slight auto tune on here as well. And I'm gonna listen back to the second track and um, see how we go. And yeah, I'm not scared to admit I've used an auto tune. But it's like a quality thing, like I'd rather make sure that it's close to being right than almost there. The one you love will leave you out to dry. The one you love will make everything alright. When the one you love decides she's had enough, she's gonna walk right out now and I leave you with no trust. She's gonna leave. I kind of like that take. The one you love. Just the first line I don't like. The one you love. Will he? The one you love. It needs to be shorter. The one you love. Let's just fix that now. And then we don't have to worry about it. it needs to be shorter. And then I think we're done. At least for that first verse anyway. One, two. The one you love. The one you love. The one you love. The one you love. Alright. Let's try that. this song but I figured you know what I like Rick Wong's craziness on the uh, on the guitar and I love the drum and bass feel and uh, it's worth fixing up and finishing so I don't know uh, here we go the one you love will leave you out to dry the one you love Sucked. So I'll put that there. 
and I call this bottom track vocal final so I know not to get confused with the other two. Let's hear how that works. As fast as hands can shake Yeah. 
original track because it's it's just shit it had no vibe and it didn't really have any um, sort of like direction it was kind of messy which is why I really wanted to redo this anyway all right you're looking at me looking at a computer screen here so uh, hopefully this isn't too painful for you but this is the last listen through of the vocal parts that I've just re-recorded and then what I also did was chop all the bits from my second take and put the better bits in so I have a feeling this uh, this will be about it what I'll do also is remove any of the vocal parts from the previous take which I'm not going to use because what that I tend to do is not only get confused with uh, which track I kind of like, but if now I'm not happy with it or a certain part, rather than just picking from what was left of that other take, I'll actually just drop that section out and redo it. Um, if I think I can actually do it better. Uh, like I said, it's not my strength, but I'm gonna give it another go. So if I need to. <laughs> bits where certain lines need to come up because the uh, groove either gets louder or I didn't sing it loud enough but the take's good so I can individually like boost any line I like just by cutting it and then like raising the volume level and this is really cool I might actually do a, a bit of a new endo tutorial on what I've learned in the last well however long it's been maybe like uh, four months I've been using it or something like that or maybe six months and uh, yeah I'll give everybody a bit of a a uh, bit of a rundown on what, how I use it anyway, whether it's right or wrong. So here we go. Yeah, both those lines need to come up. Oh, that's 
got to go. All right, this is good. This is what we need to do. So let's uh, let's re-sing that line because uh, that's going to kill me. I I couldn't listen to that back without going. Ugh. All right, let's do this again. We'll strike you down. This part can be frustrating, but you know. The idea is to, like I said before, try and get it to where you're happy with it, or you being the person uh, recording or producing and all that sort of stuff, so that being me. So here we go again. Strike you down. It's alright. And here I'm running from your broken town. That's when the will. That's when the will. Pack its bags. Reminding you the things you wanted. There's one more line I want to fix. It is now uh, 11.55, so I've been at this nearly an hour. This is just what you're gonna do to get it done. Reminding you of things you once had had. Now, I just did that last line as well, just in case. Now we can AB that new line as well, so. Reminding you it's best. Reminding you Alright, it tapers down. That's the problem. You you Alright. Time to get this right. Reminding you. Alright, that might be better. Short and cool. Alright, that's got it. I think I'm done. Could I do this better if I spent another three hours? Yeah. But, every day off, I've been working on my album. And you know what? I want to do something else. And it's at a point now where, you know, I've mixed and mastered all of the other songs except for these two. Well, this one and the other one, which I've, I'm going to go back to after this and, and just uh, splice all the vocal parts together, which is what I'm doing now. But I've actually already sung it all. So um, I, reckon, uh, I reckon I'm done, which is cool. We'll leave out and dry. Let's go to that last one. Needs to be a low one. Fire out, man. Reminding you. All right, that's done. That is done. Well, that's a bit about the process. It took an hour to do two vocal tracks, cut them up, and then also um, like do all the editing, like all the splicing, volume changes, put all the effects on and tinker with the reverb, you know, try to get it to sound like it fits in the song. And, uh, yeah, so it's just over an hour. Um, and that's the process. So I don't know how long this video is or will be, but thanks for watching. And if you want to leave any comments, that's cool. And 
I am aware I'm not the greatest singer in the world, and far from it. So, you know, if you have actually any recording questions or comments or, you know, suggestions or pro productive or proactive suggestions or comments, please leave them. Yeah, I look forward to answering some questions. Thanks all. Cheers.